Alright, David Harry here, and in this video I'm going to show you what I consider to be the best balanced settings to get 1080p60 from Fortnite on a Mac Mini M1. And for these settings I'm concentrating on really good looking picture quality at 60 frames per second in 1080. So quickly let me just go over my settings here. So as far as the picture is concerned, as we can see up here, it is 1080 and it's locked to 60. Now it's locked to 60 because if you've only got a 60 hertz monitor, you're wasting processing and frame rates for anything above the 60. So I'm going to lock it to the 60. Now if we come down and have a look at some of the settings here, the most important one as far as picture quality is concerned is 3D resolution. That is up to 100%. Now view distance is on a medium there. Now. I'd like to push that a bit higher, but medium will do. And again, I'm looking to get the best possible looking picture that I can at the moment for this thing. Now, shadows is on medium. I personally could do with shadows being off, but I'll leave them on because some people like to have shadows on. So that's the lowest setting for shadows there. Now, anti-aliasing is something else which actually helps the picture to look good because it'll kind of, you know, get all the edges sorted on objects and things like that. Now, I've got that at high. I could have pulled it down a bit more and pushed something else, but I've left that at high. I personally like anti-aliasing to be as high as possible. And then textures, once again, the textures will also make the picture look pretty, as it were, so get that up high. Effects, I'm not so bothered about the effects per se only because in this instance I'm going for the best looking picture so effects are okay down at low and then post processing is another thing that will also help the picture to kind of look nice and stuff and pretty in this instance I put it on medium only because once you start pushing it higher it will definitely affect frame rate now weirdly here I've got v-sync switched on because for some weird reason v-sync off and on doesn't affect the frame rate so I don't even know if it's working correctly to be honest but with it being on it doesn't affect the frame rate at all so no blur or nothing like that and I've got the FPS counter on so let me go back here let me jump into a game so what I'm going to do here, I'm not going to talk all the way through this, I'm only talking at the beginning just so that people can know exactly what's going on. In fact, right now what I'm going to do is just yeah, cut away to my desktop. So here's the desktop for my computer. As you can see, this is a Mac Mini M1 and also if you have a look at the graphics setting there as well. On the graphics you can clearly see that I'm in there 1080 as well. Okay, so back to the game then. What I'm going to do is once the game starts proper i'm just going to shut up and i'm just going to let it go through i'll run around it's not going to be competitive or anything this is literally for people to just kind of you know scroll through the video and have a look at some of the pictures and the video and see what they think and make their own mind up over these things now here's the thing at this point here and when it gets to the battle bus you may see the frame rate drop slightly below 60 but that's okay in my mind what it is i've got all the balance right so that once we're in the game proper on the floor we're maintaining 60 frames per second so we might see the odd dip here somewhere or we might see it when i hit the battle bus but once i hit the floor like i say it's just solid all the way then anyways what i'll do i'll just meander around here oh there we are we're on the battle bus now right so what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna jump out shortly and then like i say i will just do like a bit of time you just scroll through the video and have a good look at the pictures and stuff it's not competitive gameplay this is just for people to gauge what the picture looks like at the highest possible quality that i can get at 60 frames per second in 1080 and then the other thing i'd like to say is it is mega responsive the response on this is just outstanding it's amazing so what i'm going to do now dive out the battle bus there we can see the frame rate probably dipped a tiny bit as I jumped out and as I do this mad stuff now which is mega responsive actually hasn't dropped any frames there either okay there's a fair chance I might have been able to push one of those other settings a little bit higher than what it was but the problem is as soon as you push any, push any one of those settings a bit higher it just tends to tip it over the edge and stops you from getting 60 frames per second okay so what i'm gonna do now once i hit the floor i'm gonna shut my face hole and then i'm just gonna go for about five six seven minutes or so and like i say you just dip in and out of this video and you have a look at it and you get out of it what you want okay
Okay, so I think that'll just about do it for this video. So if you've liked it, please give us a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing to my channel. Maybe click on that bell notification icon as well to be notified of other similar videos. And the last thing for me to say right now is I'm David Harry. Thank you very much for watching this video. Take care and goodbye now.